spontaneously decided I just want to redo my entire room. <laughs> start off by painting it which I'm in the process of this whole side of my room is not painted but I did start painting this side back during quarantine <laughs> Uh, this is what we're working with. I took down all my wall prints, which was kind of sad because I've had them for so long and I really love them, but I just want to change, you know? I just know once it's all painted, it's going to be so much brighter and happier in here. I'm going to pour some paint in here. I'm probably going to have to buy new paint very soon. I had this leftover from when I painted my room the first time. This is always so satisfying for some reason. <laughs> We are halfway done. Well, I think my hands are like starting to callous, but it's looking so good I think I'm gonna go today until I run out of paint Which is probably gonna be soon and then I'm gonna have to get a Home Depot and get more. Here's what we've got so far This side is pretty much done and then this wall up here All we have left really is like this But this is gonna be difficult because we got a mirror there That's really heavy curtains that I do not know how to take down in this mirror that is like bolted to the wall so, Oh and these so Hi, so it's the next day. We're just keeping going on with it. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna give like a little bit of a haul because I got a few things today. I ordered a bunch from Amazon, like a rug, and then I also did a bunch of Instagram polls last night about this or that like room decor because I'm so indecisive and I need your guys' help. Starting off, I got some photo prints. I haven't looked at these yet, so we're about to get like a first time view of here. They're so cute. I got them from Etsy. Oh my god, wait, I love them. They're in the size like 11 by 16, I think. So there's this really pretty mountain one, a surfing one super cute this is like the little shore beach thing and i went and got some frames these were super cheap they're debatably broken i don't even know but they're gonna work we're gonna make it work i got them on sale for 7.49 because frames can be expensive guys so i found these and they're cute and they're like silver so it'll match my nightstand which is perfect and i went ahead and got three of those for the three pictures oh my gosh um, I got this frame and wow, this is not a frame. I got this circular mirror for above my dresser. This was one of the polls that I had you guys vote for. It was either circular mirror or more like rectangular mirror for above my dresser and circular mirror won. So went ahead and got that. I'm just going to start to work on putting everything up because it's coming together and I'm so excited. It's looking really good. Oh, this one has that little sticker and I just got a new set of acrylics so this is so hard to get off. I can't put it up with my cheap $7 frames. There has to be like an easy way to get these things off that doesn't like leave sticky residue. I just don't know it. Look how good they're looking. I'm obsessed. It's gonna look so cute. I got all the pictures and the frames and guys one of the frames is like 10 billion times more secure than the others. So that is definitely affecting where I want to place them on my bed because oh Honestly, I want the most secure frame above where I sleep because it's less likely to fall down on my face in the middle of the night I don't know. So like that's the most secure frame So I have it in the middle but low-key I like that one in the middle more, but I don't mind this I guess I don't know does it even matter? It's just all gonna go up there However, our next move is going to be figuring out how the heck I balance and level and straighten these things out by myself because I'm alone <laughs> I mean, I have a level. I'm just gonna wing it. This is gonna be interesting Man, I don't even know what I'm doing at all. Take level. I need to stand on the bed. Oh, I 
Debbie. Wait, there's a pencil in this thing. This little thing's kind of cool. I got it from Amazon and it's a level. It's like a normal level, right? And then it has these little pokey things and you just press it down and it'll poke a hole where you want the nail to go. And then also there's a pencil so you can like, I don't know, draw on your wall. <laughs> Will that be centered on my bed? Honestly, I could just move my bed to adjust the paintings if worse comes to worse. I also don't want this to fall on my head. I'm kind of concerned about that. I really, I'm scared. I don't want it to fall on my face. It's not quite what I wanted. <laughs> I'm so bad at this. All right, let me show you guys the little situation we got up here. I accidentally nailed it all the way into the wall and like I can't get it out. I feel like I'm maybe making progress. Mm, okay, no. <laughs> so should I just put one like right next to it? All right. Update, I just put a second nail right next to it and I'm just gonna try to hang it up. Ooh, wait, wait a second. Did I do something here? I'm thinking it's too far to the side though. What do you guys think? But it's up there and it looks good. That's all that matters. Update, I have an idea and I'm gonna call my boyfriend and ask him to help me so like I'll set him up on FaceTime and then he can be like, to the left, to the left, please. I'll try it, okay, I'm gonna try Ainsley. Somebody answer me, please. Hi, can you help me? Like, if I prop you up, can you tell me if I need to move anything? Oh, wait, that poster's so cute! Is that not one of those level things right there? Well, like, I have a level, but I want it to be centered in the middle of the bed. Okay, I guess you could always move the bed. <laughs> I know, that's what I was thinking, but then I didn't paint around my headboard. <laughs> so that's my current problem! Okay, okay, wait, move your butt, your butt's blocking it. Also, you have a big hole in your butt. Yeah, the one that you have on the wall, can you not just move it over to the right a little bit? <laughs> How'd you do that? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't just originally set them on the headboard. That would have been so much smarter of me. Let's try this again. Should probably take these down just in case. Um, how does that look? That looks pretty good, right? I wish I had a measuring tape or something. Should I try to use my hand? Um, uh, maybe not a pinky. It's about one and a fist. Well, I feel like maybe this one should go over. And then that one a little bit. So now it's looking like that. Just look at this. Ah, it looks so good. But then I went ahead and put a nightstand here. All this is from Amazon, by the way. A nightstand, my sunset lamp, also from Amazon. I'll link these all down below for you guys because look, it looks so good with my little disco ball planter and the artwork. Like it's just such a little vibe. And I got all this over there. All right, so next I kind of want to go ahead and put up the mirror. I don't know if I can put it up alone though, to be honest, because it's like really heavy. Ugh, I don't even know how to hang it up. I might just try to see. We're at Home Goods right now looking for some home decor for the new room. All time besties. I just got back from Home Goods, decided to do a little shopping for like kind of knickknacks, but it was really picked over. But I did manage to get some stuff. I got this really pretty globe. I love the green color of it. I'm just obsessed with the color green. This is what they look like. They have these like white polka dots on them. Super cute. Gonna put some flowers in them for my nightstand. But they didn't have any plants there at the store I went to. I got a little mini version of it too. Where can I find like not super expensive fake plants? Because I'm gonna need a lot of those. And then I also got some new pillows. I fell in love with these. Like just look at this. And then this pink one to go with it. I love it so much. And I thought it would look really good with this blue pillow I already have. As you can tell, Anna can't pick a color scheme for anything. So I'm kind of just like mix matching the vibes because I am too indecisive for this. I'm gonna need to go get some plants and a lot of them. Wait, 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 hold up. Oh, it almost fell. I forgot like the biggest thing that I got. How could I forget? I got this because I decided that I want to make that random wall over there a plant wall. I found a bunch of inspo on Pinterest. Here it is. It's this big black circle with some shelves that I'm gonna put some succulents on, which I think will be really cute and perfect for that wall. Okay, now, peace out. I'm quite literally sitting in a bed of plants, so I have a little unboxing haul. Um, I don't even know. But I'm gonna be assembling my plant wall today, which I'm so excited, and just putting a bunch of accessories in my room. One being, I got a jewelry holder for my desk because I have a lot of necklaces that are just like all over the place. 
I got a bunch of different little plant holders so that I can put my succulents in them for the plant wall, which I think will be really cute. And I'm gonna like mix and match all of them. Yeah, I got a bunch of different ones. They're all different colors, shapes, everything. Basic white one. I love this. It's like a geometric shape kind of plant holder, if you know what I mean. I got a bigger one for my desk. I'm gonna put just like a bigger kind of plant in this one. It's so cute and it's got some blue scallops on it. Another plant mister, even though my plants are all currently fake. One, I'm really bad at keeping plants alive. Two, since I'm like back and forth from here and Atlanta all the time, I don't want to like get real plants because they're just gonna die. Another fake plant, foam block to stick them in, and I'm gonna make it look as realistic as possible. Oh, and they're down on the floor. Hold on. Oh, I'm gonna fall. I'm gonna fall. Okay. A lot. Okay. These are the fake flowers I got to put in my vases, which I got before, which you guys already saw. So that's what's gonna go in these. I think they're really pretty and they match like the vibe of my pillows right there. But today is going to be a huge room room day. I'm going to be spending like all day with my mom on it because she's going to help me paint. We got more paint finally. I know everyone was really hating on me for that for fair reasoning. Also, I only did like one layer of paint, so it's definitely going to need some more paint. It has a bit of a blue undertone to the paint, but we're going to fix that. Sun goes down, but we get back again. Trouble is a silly thing. It always ends up breaking. got all my plants together now they look so cute and i'm about to assemble them on their little circle thing on the wall the paint is pretty much done and yes i finally painted behind that and it looks so much better like there's no blue under it now but i'm gonna start the plants All right, and this is the final product of the plant wall. I still don't know. Kind of might add like some pictures around to make it a gallery wall too. I think that would look good. But I just added a little bit of crystals and some fake plants, a little watering thing. And it is so cute, I think. And now I have my desk here. It's very plain, simple, empty. And I really love the look. I've seen them all over Pinterest. Like, I don't want to say cluttered because that sounds negative. Maximalist vibe desk, if you know what I mean. So this is kind of the inspo I got from Pinterest. And you know what I'm going for. I really love it and I got some random knickknacks all around town. Just a bunch of different things. Yeah, I bought like plants, a globe, randomness, and we are gonna try to make this look good. All right, so I have one of my vases here. It's the smaller one, and I filled it with the really pretty fake purple flowers, and oh, I just sneeze. And I'm just gonna put them on the desk over in the corner probably. I don't really know. I definitely want the globe on the desk. I really like this plant. And maybe my sunglasses. Let's see, let's see. Oh, and I have this jewelry holder that I for sure want. So this is definitely gonna be in the corner just in case because I don't want it to fall on me in my sleep. Okay, then we got a plant maybe there. Globe, I don't, mm, no. Maybe globe will go over here. Jewelry, right? Are we thinking like, sorry, my window glare is really bad right now, but I can't close the blinds because the paint's drying. But I'm thinking like right in the middle and then maybe the globe in the corner over here by my extension cord. Alrighty, and now we have my dresser. So this is what it looks like with nothing on it. And I really wanna put my sunglasses in the corner there. I love this little piece of artwork. Work. It's of me and my boyfriend. Somebody drew it for me and it's so cute. But yeah, and then I'm thinking maybe another vase right there. We, I don't know. Okay, wait, can we take a moment? Look how pretty the light coming through the vase is. That's so pretty. Okay, anyways, so I'm thinking this should go right there next to my jewelry box. Ooh, that looks really good. And then maybe, wait, and then a plant on top. Yes, wait. And then my sunglasses. Okay, wait, I'm getting way too excited. I need two hands for this. No matter what they call it. So excited. Guys, just, just look at this. Just look at this masterpiece. I am so proud of myself. Like, how did I do that? That looks so good. And then look, here's the desk. Like, what? It looks so good all together. I can't. And I love the circle mirror too.
beautiful so my room is officially done and i love it so much like it's actually my dream room it turned out exactly how i imagined it looks so different like i actually can't and i'm gonna give you guys a quick little rundown of the room this isn't gonna be like a room tour or anything though because i want to make a whole separate room tour video and go into depth and where everything is from so i will definitely do that next but yes so let me give you a quick run through all right so this is what you see when you open the door we got the new prints up and that is actually new so check out my tiktok if you want to see that nightstand i got this chair recently it looks super good <clears throat> the only thing is this wall right here is kind of empty but i'm like do we like it empty i don't know yet so that's the only thing i'm like maybe i'll change it plant wall is looking so good i'm actually in love with it it's so cute i have all my bags hanging up on my door right here all the pillows look really good together i love all the colors this area honestly might be my favorite once again check out my tiktok to see those plant holders and then this is my dresser it's looking really good i just love that sunglasses holder so much and my desk of course just so cute i just love the globe i'm actually obsessed if you can't tell guys but yeah so this is like a quick overview of it i'm so much happier with my room now like you don't even know like before i never even wanted to film in my room because I just didn't really like it and now I just think it looks so good and like mirror selfies so cute right here right so I hope you guys love the room makeover let me know what you think or if I should add anything else to it and yeah if you haven't already you should follow me on TikTok and Instagram wherever else subscribe here turn on the post notifications I don't know whatever else there is to do but yeah I'm just so thankful for you guys and I love you so much and I will see you in the next video I hope you guys have the best week ever bye, bye.